I would like to start with a short introduction about Mittelstand International, the Association for Small and Medium Sized Enterprises, which have their headquarter here in Shanghai, is spreading out from Shanghai into China and further on. So I gave the speech to you. <laughs> I have summarized the presentation for Mittelstand International into some main headlines, basics, introduction services. Of course, we cannot do everything free of charge, the service fees, and some information about our sponsors. Mittelstand International, as I already mentioned, is the association of small and medium-sized enterprises. We have some real basics. The WE stands for Entrepreneurship, Innovation, Sustainability, International and Responsibility. Here on the right side you already see some of our members. Uh, one of our members is a general manager in a, in a chemical company here in, in China. And nearly all of the Chinese have their product already in hands. If you are using an iPhone 4, all the um, silver uh, plating and the silver color plating and the iPhone 4 is from this company, from the company Schneck in, in China. Mittelstand International is a network for entrepreneurs, business owners and key decision makers and we are delivering an, an outstanding service performance and this we have summarized in our claim, committed people. So if you need any assistance, please contact us and we are at your doorstep. Also here you will see two of our members on top. It's a company who is producing ship cranes for the maritime industry and in the bottom once again the metal pigment company Mittelstand International, the association of small and medium sized enterprises is working independent and without any involvement of political force and government advice and we even do not get any government subsidies so we are totally organized with our membership scheme. Now I would like to come to your benefits which are coming up where we can help you in a one-stop solution. We can assist you in cooperation management, operational questions, information management, if you have any problems with your financial institutions, finding cooperation partners and a very new topic, searching for technologies, also cross borders and getting contacts to authorities, either local, regional, national and even international. How we do bring these, all these activities to you, we have several platforms. Tonight we have our get together, which is here in Shanghai, a monthly event. In other places, either be monthly or quarterly. Sometimes we organize business breakfast, comes company tours, exclusive seminars, working groups to specific issues, for example, automotive industry, chemical industry, entrepreneur conferences, social events and mix us with other groups, which we had last week in Suzhou, together with DUSA, the European Association, and um, with uh, Steinbeis Research Institute. 
Where we are by the time with our event places, you see three places which are far off from Shanghai. This is Beijing, this is Qingdao and Chengdu. And here in the Yangtze River Delta, we are from Shanghai to Changchou and south of the Hangzhou Bay in Hangzhou and Ningbo. Some headlines about previous seminars which we have organized. You see it's quite a, a big variety. We strive legal, we have production, human resource, tax construction, uh, building construction, corporate design, and even once a national topic which was which was very well received beyond Marco Polo. We have I call him a, a very crazy member in our in our association. He is an active motorbike rider and he took his BMW from Shanghai directly to Lisbon in a 70 days ride and gave us some insights about this uh, about this uh, journey. Also company events, I think you see quite a big number also of well-known company, Gibberit, HCO, Valorec, and Bosch, Schlenk, and some more. These events give you the possibility to get in deep into these companies and to learn more and to share also ideas. Now I'm coming to our part members only. We have established in Shanghai Pudong a business lounge and one of our members, it's the company Ecovis, they, they provide a meeting, a meeting area for all of our members who are in need in Pudong, which they can use for a half day to settle their meetings and will get all the technical equipment which they need for a successful meeting. And now I am coming to our international network. We are part of an international network with roughly 160,000 members worldwide in Europe, Asia and the Americas. And we have a lot of rep offices around the globe. So that means also if a Chinese company wants to go abroad or an overseas company wants to come to China, you are always linked to Mittelstand. Some of the faces, they make the daily business. Two in Germany, for example, one in the US. One is even here tonight, our colleague from Russia and Central Asia. We have Austria and also Sweden. We have two packages for our services. We have the standard package, standard manufacturing, which includes the participation in all our events worldwide, integration of your company with all the data into our database. A very interesting topic, our free service hotlines for law and tax, you can use or utilize our business lounge and if you have individual needs, please address it and we will assist you. And the upgraded one, our VIP package, this includes additional advertisement possibilities to our members. Some a little bit more in deep to successful events which we had in the past. This was an exclusive event with a lawyer here in, in Shanghai to the topic corruption, fraud and unfair competition. We only had one table, 10 participants, one speaker and myself out of the automotive industry only 
GMs out of the automotive industry. It was a big success. And you see, we had at the same evening a rebooking rate for the second event, which we had for another topic also in the automotive industry. And we even had a newspaper report some months later in a Swiss newspaper. Unfortunately, it's only German for, for the non-German speaker uh, about this event. Also, end of 2013, together with the Spanish language organization here in, in, in China, with the Instituto de Cervantes, we had our charity event uh, to collect money for children in need, for heavily disabled youngsters in the age between zero and three years, and we could collect quite a a nice sum to, to help. This was a big event in September last year, the second Asian European Management and Coaching Conference here in the Highland Band. We had a, a prominent keynote speaker, it was Mr. Dirkes, his Executive Vice President Human Resource from a small company like Volkswagen, Volkswagen Board Worldwide and roughly 150 uh, participants and very active discussions in the, in the plenum and also a special panel for our group uh, for the successes of the SME companies. Here on the top right, this lady is the Dean of the National University of Kazakhstan. And at the survey, we had a company tour at HCO in Changchou uh, to see the new plant from them. And you also can see our participants. This was a delega uh, delegation from Moscow, from the Agriculture Ministry. Uh, ministry. They were quite interested about this. This is something upcoming. 9th of June, Mittelstand International will be at the first overseas exhibition at the NEW Networking Efficiency and Knowledge Transfer in Germany. Germany at the border of Germany, Switzerland and Austria and all our members have the possibility to hand over their company information to me and we will present it to our visitors at the booth. Only for the people who are not so familiar with the German map, it's really at the end or down south in Germany at the borderline. Only some of our members to give you a rough impression what we what we have in our database or in our membership base, we have um, industrial parks, industrial parks, private owned, company owned, private owned. We have tourism organizations. We have farming truck manufacturers. We have CPAs, automotive suppliers textile suppliers, uh, IT, uh, IT agencies, um, interior design companies, tube companies, chemical and construction consultants. So it's a very wide mix and this makes it also different to others. This is one hand on, on the other side. If you see the, uh, the basis of the headquarters, they are coming from Singapore straight through Europe to America. It's not focused to a specific, not focused to a specific country. It's all over. This is a new member in which we have acquired this month. 
it's an automation company in Suzhou, a Chinese company who wants to go abroad together with Mittelstand International into European markets in the near future. It's a company which was which was founded in 2001 and have now 2,200 employees and is doing and is a single source also for a company which is already named tonight for Apple uh, in their specific in their specific area. Very successful Chinese company. And the other two uh, sponsor members, it's HECO, you have already seen, this is a farming truck manufacturer and the company Söder, they are supplying for the automotive industry. This is a short introduction about Mittelstand International. If you have any questions by the time, please feel free, we can either answer it now or I will hand over to uh, Mr. Jordan, but first I would like to to answer your question if some some arising. Uh, I, I first uh, take a moment to give a, a brief introduction of Mittelstand in Chinese for our Chinese uh, people. Uh, uh, Mittelstand's uh, Mr. Hansen Pala is Midstand Midstand is a Midstand是一个国际性的组织 还有就是他们会提供，比如说business lunch，是在浦东，他们有个office，是可以供大家享用这个office来啊开一个business meeting 啊，或者是会议啊一类的活动。然后他们除了提供中德的呃国外的企业在中国的一些服务以外，同时也帮助中国企业走出国门去投资在欧洲或者是在。Any question from, from this group? Then I would like to hand over to Mr. Jordan.